It's a good wave, let's hope not yet. Here's O'Connor, out to Ioane. Ioane going through. The wave will have to wait because Ioane has provided a wonderful piece of skill there. His timing is good, his footwork is good, and the Aussie midfield just gets on the gain line. A little bit slow, Sterling Mortlock there. The hole opens up and that's too easy for him. He's got great pace. And once he's going forward, Cipriani is never going to get to him. Not he a is chance. so good at seeing the gap, isn't he? Yeah, I mean, the Australians have worked it and they're actually prepared to pull the ball back to him. I think the Barbarians will be a little bit... ...by the Aussie circle, that's Digby Orney. But what you need to see is the gap here. Look at the dogleg between Mortlock and Fruin. And when we run this on, watch what happens. Sterling Mortlock's up, he's flat-footed, Fruin's gone wide, and there's your hole. Bang! Digby Orney finds the, dig, the, the, find, finds the dogleg, sprints through it. With that Nick White, this is Ruan Smith. Can uh, Tamua get something going here? Oh, yes! Have they snatched it? Kurindrani! It's cost them the first one, there was a little hand in there that stopped it, but this it's Tamua who's gone through the gap there and the inside pass, superb. Derek Barnes, now he gives it, there it is. This is play as well, here it is, the defence, Habana rushed up and he let Falau get in front of him and he couldn't get back quick enough and that's where the hole was, Habana rushed up, Barnes got it behind him and there's no way Jean de Villiers is going to stop, no one's going to stop Israel Falau from there, Cave. And a good tackle by Ryan Smith. Now Cowan clears it out. Slade, clean break by Slade. Now can he link up a long pass to Guilford? And Maybe it was just a flat ball, but here's Slade on the break with options running, carrying the ball in two hands. And this is a great pass to Guilford, who just pinned his ears back, didn't try and come in and got there in the end. Immensely strong work here from uh, Zach Guilford. Grant Misbet to uh, school of carrying the ball might not uh, agree so much there. Yeah, wrong hand. Some good football from both teams. It's Thurston! Oh, Jonathan Thurston to Chambers. And Will Chambers has scored the try. And he's met by his teammates at the fence. And he uses Greg Inglis up as a decoy here. Jonathan Thurston. He goes to the line and Greg Inglis appears just from the, from the inside. And then comes around and he uses Inglis as a decoy. Keep your eye on Inglis. He's behind there, jumping behind Thurston. He goes the line, he sucks in Mitchell Pierce there. And Chambers just floats on the outside there of Mitchell Pierce. Absolutely beautiful pass from the first. 10 6 Indigenous All Stars are in the lead. Remember, have a look up right. the top. It is man-on-man -man defense, so it took the ball around the outside. Ben Tapaway, he got badly caught out. And then this ball from Whitelock to Nandolo, who knows his way to the try line. 
What a super try there from the Crusaders. As you say, Marta, they had a good spread across the field. You can see the way they're trying to play. They want to spread the Reds' defence, who, who had been in good position, but that's just a great bit of skill. And that's why everyone loves playing on days like today. There's no there's no dew, there's no grease on the ball, and you can, you can really open up the skills. And you'll see plenty more of this today, particularly if one of these teams starts... Smith to Alan Alatoa. That is extraordinary. Two prop forwards combining. What a little left footer. And I think it's, a, it's been played out. But here's the feature. Ruan Smith, reserve prop to the other reserve prop. Alan Alatoa. That left footer there deserves five points immediately. Pops out now for Phipps. Beal, inside ball, nobody in front of Peter Beatham. Trump. Look at Beal, I can see it was on Wolgenia, just over covered. Out wide, it looked like it was going out wide. Curly Beal steps up to first receiver. And he looks really comfortable outside of Bernard Foley. They're chopping and changing who's playing first receiver. Beatham, perfect. He's been given a roving commission, Curtly Beal.